hey everybody and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to curve a text here in adobe express let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time here in adobe express i want you to click the sign up option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go Curving text here in Adobe Express is a simple process that can elevate your design. Once you're logged into your account, I want you to click the project or design that you're working. If you haven't already, just go to the template section wherein you can browse templates for photos, videos, and a lot more. Or just hover here down below. If you want to start from scratch, just click on the option right here wherein you can upload and edit your own content. In my case, I'm going to be choosing this one right here. All right. Go in to add a text. You can choose your own font, color, and formatting or start from a text layout. I'm going to click on it. And from here, I'm going to add a text. Right? For example, this. Going to delete some of the uh, images right here. I'm going to drag it. And for you to be able to curve it, all I'm going to do is go to the more option. You see, you don't have that, right? Go to the effects instead right here. I want you to click on the text layout. You see there's going to be an options like dynamic. You can capitalize text or that scales to fill the text field or click on circle. All right. You can text around a circle. If you do that, what will happen is you would be forwarded with a uh, elliptical kind of thing wherein you can rotate. All right. Undo that. Another option that you can do is click on the arch. Right. What will happen is it's going to be curve text here you see you have now the option for that outline thickness right here the opacity and of course of the levelness of your curve text all right because as you can see the curve text i'm going to copy this and i'm going to click on the uh, new page on the same size so we can have more visual uh, imagery right here all right going to copy that and i'm going to uh, rotate here to kind of have like um mirror effect by dragging this all the way here all right so that obviously i need to uh, make the uh, fonts like smaller so they can be like uh, have a mirror effect drag this along and from here i would be able to capitalize on it See that I'm going to drag them all the way up but that's that and that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next one